I don't know. This is crazy. This is like a um, this is like a Daedric realm of he of oblivion. It might be a realm of oblivion. This kind of kind of what it reminds me of. Look at the sky. What kind of place is this? Yep, this is place is creepy. All right, let's see if Serana has anything to say. You think a vampire would be right at home in this place? You'd be wrong. Let's just find my mother and get out of here quickly. Okay, you sure yeah. she's got it? But there's no way she would have left it in Tamriel. She wanted to get it as far away from my father as possible. I can't imagine a better place. Okay. Then we find out where she hid it. If she's still alive. Well, as alive as she was before. Or as now. Oh, okay, or... just stop talking. <laughs> you know what I mean. Probably to avoid whatever my father would do to her if he could get his hands on her. Or maybe her plan was to come back, but she was stuck here. We won't know until we find her. Okay, fair enough. Let's look around then. I see ghosts over here. Can I ask you to just stay there? The air? Wait here. If you think I'm gonna let you have all the fun, Damn it. crazy. Gah. I'll let you lead ahead, but I'll be keeping an eye on you. Okay, good. Look at... Man, this is cool. I like this place. Interesting. Weirdness. And ghosts to murderize. Okay, um, so let's sneak up on the ghost. See if we can pickpocket them. Soul husk added. What is that for? Is that a alchemical ingredient? Soul husk. Let's see if it shows up here. It might be in the miscellaneous... Nope, not there. Here, here. I don't see it. Stone of Baron Zaya, stone fragment. Okay, well, it's not there. It's not a book. Did I miss it somehow? Is it under husk, comma, soul? <laughs> Salt, snow, swamp. It's not under H. Not under H. Is it a fruit? There, oh, it's a fruit. It's a food. Interrupts the soul drain effect in the soul carn. Oh, I see. Okay, well, cool. Pickpocket the soul, you damn you are damn straight. Damn skippy. Me, as though I am still alive and being drawn and quartered. I can't stand it anymore. Okay. Get out while you can. I'm trying to pickpocket you, jerk. Don't like those eyes you've got. There's a bad hunger to them. Okay, Saul. Is there no end to this nightmare? There, is there no end Okay, great. To this so you're just going to talk me endlessly. I was trying to... Man, I wish I could have pickpocketed him. Who knows what he would have had? I will rob anything that it's possible for me to rob. That is for sure. Harvest soul fisher. Oh, this place is awesome. I love it. I want to make a... Can we have a house here? Let's talk to this guy. Or her. Girl. Did you know I visited elsewhere once? Really? What a strange and wondrous place. You don't say. Elsewhere is the homeland of the Khajiit. Get out while you can. Okay, okay. So apparently there's going to be a soul drain effect. That looks like almost like a stone sword or something. This place is awesome. <laughs> Got to build a house here. Going to move in. Going to have little soul children, little soul babies. I bet I cannot walk past this wall though. Watch this. Bzing. 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 Yep, can't walk through there. I told you to stay put! I'm looking around! The lady is so disobedient. Okay, uh, let's continue looking around. Another thingy sticking out of the ground. No idea what it is. Um, ooh. Okay, I'm gonna touch this, but I'm gonna save it before I touch it. Ah, okay. Now I'm like, I have sun blindness from staring at that fire. And 
I'm gonna pick up all these soul husks because they may be important. Even if they're not important, I just want some for my collection of things that are completely meaningless. Maybe I'll put them around my house as decoration. What's this? Is this anything? Just a rock. Okay. Well, um... I don't see anything screaming out like, hey, uh, Vampire Lady lives here. We've seen a few of these bonfires. Uh, but they're not unique. I wonder if that's something way over there, that fire I can barely see. There's maybe this building here in the center? Maybe that's probably it. Harvest soul stuff. But uh, before I go down to that center area, I'm going to look around the outside edges. Take some more of these husks. Husk, 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 husk! Sound you make that 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 right there. That's the sound you make when you kick something or someone. Husk. Don't ask me why. It's just the sound you make. Oh, here we go. This is a building of some sort. Um. So there's a ghost over there. Huh. All right. Let's check out the center area first. Then we'll come over here. This building is bigger. Might be more important. Bones all over the place. Somebody's been here. They must have had a party. Didn't invite me. Oh, and look at this. Uh, like a gate thing. Oh, man. How big is this area? Well, uh, the maps aren't very good for this kind of thing. There's another building there. A building there. Okay. <laughs> This area is bigger than I thought it would be. Yep. Okay, so let's go check out this tower then. And maybe this rock right here? Maybe we can find something around the rock. There's another tower thingy over there. Yes, okay, so we're gonna have to like, comb the area basically. Ooh. I can't seem to get up that slope. There's a dragon skull, looks like. Hmm. Very, very interesting. Yeah, I, I don't see a way to get up to it without jumpy jumping. Let's jumpy jump. Jump, and jump, and jump. Oh, it won't let me. Okay, there's an invisible barrier there. All right, let's check out this little house. See if there's anything in here. Whoa. That's a oh hi, a bone man. Oh wow, okay, you got some hip hits. Oh yeah, you lost track of me, didn't you? Because I snucked. Archery to eighty one. All right, I'm just gonna shoot you right in the back. Look at all that stuff's looking out of you. That's right. All right, um, since. That's our first one. It's all right if you resurrect him, I think. And you're using an ancient Nord sword thingy in this place? Really? Okay, what do we got? Soul gem. Yubs Opus, page six. Quickly stifled by the sound of over a hundred wings. Okay, incomplete sentence. Rising from the Foyata was an entire colony of cliff racers. Cliff racers! <laughs> they were out for blood. It was a trap! The damn things have become much too clever. And the chest. Aha. Daedric arrows, gold. Nice. Okay. Uh, queen. Oh, okay, this is it, huh? Alright. Uh, let's go look over. Where was that building? Is this it over here? Ooh, there's a staircase there. That I think that's where we came in. Okay, let's look over here. So that guy had a lot of hit points, but um, didn't seem too challenging otherwise. What's here? Another chest? Black... Yeah! Black soul gem. Awesome. Weird column. Strange walls with square holes in them. Who's there? Oh! 
Why wow, wouldn't you shoot that? Oh. Okay. Done oh. Done. All right. Fine. Take all the fun. Why don't you? Another a gem. Okay. Oh, okay, boom man. Suck it. Let's go look at that crystal. That is a big crystal. Looks quite ominous. It's right on the edge of the uh, the Soul Cairn map. Anything down here? Here. Yes. Yeah. That's right. All right. What'd you have on you? Another black soul gem. Awesome. Okay. Can we do anything with? Whoa! What's going on? What's going on? Stop it! I wonder if that's the soul drain. Hup. No, no, damn it, I didn't mean to do that. I damn, I just took all of that. Okay, drop that. How did I get so heavy? Is it all those uh soul thingies? Must be. Master's robe. Okay, put that on. I'm not sure what all I picked up. Maybe the... No, these are only a tenth of a pound, so it can't be them. I do have a lot of other random miscellaneous crap in here, though. I don't need these. Okay, whatever. Oh, it hurts! It hurts! <laughs> I wonder if that is the, um... The soul drain effect. That, uh, those things protect you from. I don't know. Okay, so what exactly are we supposed to be doing here? Locate Valerica. Valerica. So far, I have not located her. Okay, um, well, let's look... Over here, then, on this side. We haven't been over here yet. There's another ghost. Let's, let's see if this ghost can tell us anything. Probably not. There's a, ooh, a dog. Or a horse. Is it friendly? Are you friend or foe? Hi! Beware the dragon Dunavir. Dunavir? Ooh, is there a shadow dragon in here? Whoa! This is no place for you. No kidding. There's no escape. What a horrible place. So, we're gonna have to fight a shadow dragon, I would bet. Whoa. Speaking of which... Whoa. Hey, come get some. Get out of the ground. Let's go. Let's do it. Okay, well, um, let's just continue looking around then. Oh, lightning! Shadow lightning! Hey, buddy, who's this over here? Well, look what oh, Morvan Stroud. With flesh on their bones. Let's just say I sold something to a guy who turned out to work for a whole coven of necromancers. That was not smart. How in the name of Zenithar was I to know the ingredients were phony? Do I look like someone that would double cross a necromancer? Kinda. Got it. Horse, wagon, and all. Plopped here without so much as a word. I used to be one of the best traders in High Rock, you know. Now people would track me down just to see what I had for sale. Okay, do you have anything left? Very funny. Oh. And what exactly are you going to pay me with? Take a look around. Gold doesn't exactly win you any friends around here. Um, I got soul husks. I'll tell you what. I appreciate what you're trying to do, so I'll play along. The only thing I see around here uh -huh. are soul husks. Uh, we will say 25 of them. Okay. And you can rummage through what odds and ends I've gathered over the years. Well, tell me what you're looking for, and maybe we can make a deal. Ooh. If you have the husks. Look at this. 
Um, light armor, battle axe, or a sword. Let's go for some light armor. Mm. I want to sell you stuff because I'm a little encumbered right now. Give me a sword. A wondrous blade. It... Never mind. Just take the darn thing. Iron sword of sapping. Iron sword. Of... That sounds crappy. <laughs> Ten points. Are you serious? Brought some soul husks. Or are you wasting my time? You're wasting my time with that garbage. I am a high class thief here. I demand only the best. Whoa, okay, lightning, chill out. Okay, let's oh come on. Let's jump over here. Job be oh god, that's gonna hurt a little bit. Can we go back there? Oh, there's a treasure chest. Can I get back there? I don't see any levers to pull. Okay, whatever, fine. Um, let's head over to this tower. That looks very ominous, and there's lightning thump in the ground. Is uh, Selena still following me? I haven't seen her. Oh, there she comes. Okay, I'm stuck in the trees. Okay, uh, she's got to be over here at this column of light here. This is... Oh, wait, no, never mind. There's two over there. It's not unique. <laughs> I thought we'd discovered something, but I guess not. Okay, what are we doing? Where are you? Man, uh, I bet this is it. Hello. Oh, hi, horsey. Hi! Hi! Oh, can I have a horse like that, please? That's the coolest horse I've ever seen! And, oh! Damn! Come back! That is a cool looking horse. I want one of those. Okay, Lightning, stop it! Uh oh. Wrathman? Whoops! Why are they that equipped? <laughs> oh, yeah! Sorry. Right. Damn it. Here we go. Dang it. Can't loot him. Okay, let's see. Anything any treasure? I thought we need to go up this guy. If there is a path somehow. This looks Wow, okay. Yeah, this got to be it. What do you think? Uh-oh. Whoa, big dude! Whoosh! Suck it, big dude. Keeper. Yeah, that's right. That's right, a little shadow effect. A little smoke coming off my... My hands. Oh! Darn it. Stand still. There you go, right in your back. Right between the chinks of your armor. And, yeah, there we go. Five ebony arrows, dragon bone battle axe. 3,000 just for the axe, not even enchanted. But damn, is it heavy. And uh, that reminds me. Let's see, those. that's full, that's full. Um, this needs to be filled. Let's fill this guy. There we go. Okay. Um, nothing, huh? Can we not get up in this guy? I guess not. Well, this is not where we need to go. Let's keep looking. I suppose we'll find it sooner or later. What's over here? Candle? Nothing again. Alright. What about over here? There's another ghost. Hey! Soul gem. That's what it was. Then I must be. Oh, no. I I bet I have sent a lot of people here what from capturing people in soul place. gems. Alright, lightning. I get the point. Let's try and see where it's striking. 
over here. Is that a clue? Are we supposed to follow it? Oh, look at this. There's a door. Reaper's Lair. Whoa! Do it again! Yes! That's crazy. Activate Reaper Shard Receptacle. You lack the required item. Reaper Shard Receptacle. Apparently we need a Reaper Shard. Ah! Okay. Great. We're going to bring some kind of freaking Steinian monster to life? I don't know. But now at least we have that. Um, I guess we could just... Let's just follow the quest. There's a little... I mean, I've been just kind of wandering around in here, but we could just resort to the, uh, the boring old tactic of following the quest log. A little quest marker. A little questy marker. Should lead us straight to where we need to go. To this rock. No, not to this rock. Are you talking to yourself over here? Oh, yo. What do you want? I found your note. How does anyone expect me? To write my opus with all of these rude interruptions. What opus? What do I mean, indeed? If I hadn't lost all of the pages, I wouldn't be in this predicament, and we wouldn't be having this conversation. I smell a quest, Gain. Very well. I suppose a moment or two of my time couldn't hurt. I am Jib. Some call me Saint Jib. Others call me Jib the Eradicator. Perhaps you've heard of me. Nope. I can't say that I'm surprised by your answer. Until I get my second volume published, no one will ever know of my achievements. All right, great. A book? I'd hardly call a 26-volume epic simply a book. Surely you've heard of the rise and fall of Saint Jim the Eradicator, hero of Morrowind, savior of the Dunmer. <laughs> no? Uh, maybe a shorter title? Maybe you should leave the writing to an expert. Stop making foolish suggestions. <laughs> How's it going so far then, eh, buddy? Terrible. Simply terrible. I was in the midst of writing the second volume, and they just threw me into this prison. It's unfair. Okay. So what? What in the name of a Vic are you talking about? All I remember is that damn Dramora and his minions bursting into my home and sending me to their prison. Okay, great. Well, I assume so. It cast a spell at me from some kind of strange black crystal. You got soul trapped, buddy. Next thing I knew, I arrived here. Your soul was trapped. My what? Wait. That means... You're dead. Yep. No. All these wasted months has been years. I don't even remember how much time has passed. No, my work will never see the light of day. My name will be forgotten. Um, okay. Can I help? <laughs> Do you have a way out of here? Yes. Maybe I can't leave. But my writings can. In order to write the second volume of my opus, I need the notes from my first volume. Otherwise, I need to do all of this from memory. Okay, how many pages? I was tossed in here. I felt myself falling, and I dropped the pages I had been holding. There were ten of them in all. Find them for me, please. I beg you. All right, I guess so. Well, that's a ridiculous question. Everyone traveling through here has said that the Oblivion Gates have been opening all over town. Oh, you've been in here a while, huh? Has it been that long? Oh my. 300 years! Well, 
It started with the followers of Mehrun's Dagon, having Emperor Uriel Septim the Seventh assassin. Yeah. The Septim on the throne of the Empire. Mm -hmm. Dagon was able to leave Oblivion through the gates and attack. Is that without a Septim sitting on the throne of the Empire, the dragon fires in a yeah, yeah. Great. that we were yep. Well, I don't I can only assume the gates have been okay. closed. Okay. Great. Now. Shut up. Yep, we already played that game. Ancient history, buddy. Uh, we were heading in the direction we're supposed to go this way. Okay. <laughs> Enough dawdling and meandering around. Yep. So if we just follow the arrow. So here we go. This must be. Is this. Ooh, look at all these. Hey, Saul. I yearn to see the great dudes of the Hammerfell once again. Nope, I don't think it's gonna happen. Nice cow, though. Okay, is this taking me in the right direction? Maybe up to these towers? Is that where we need to go? Could be. Yep, I bet it is. Right up here to the edge. Ooh, very ominous. Okay, let's run around the side here. Yeah, that's a cool house. Can I buy this? I want to live here. Look at this thing. Oh, I can't walk through the wall. Can't walk through the wall. Why can't I walk through the wall? Hey, lady. Hey, lady. Hey. Damn it. What am I supposed to... Oh, I have to wait for you. Can't be. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? Yep. No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to complete the prophecy our way, not his. Wait a minute. You've brought a stranger here? Have you lost your mind? Yep. No, you don't. You, come forward. I would speak with you. So how has it come to pass that a vampire of mixed blood is in the company of my daughter? Look, lady. I am Linkso the Night Cat, near of Varine. Saver of the world. Safe? You call bringing her here safe? Has she explained nothing to you? Serana has sacrificed everything to prevent Harkon from completing the prophecy. I would have expected her to explain that to you. Okay, give me that you think I'd have the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. What? When I fled Castle Volkahar, I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. The second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. Okay. Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summoning day. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. Okay, so the tyranny of the sun requires her blood? Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Serana. And why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far from her as possible. Ah, so Harkin's gonna sacrifice if her, Harkon huh? Harkon obtained Ariel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon. The tyranny of the sun would be complete. In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. Uh-huh, okay, great, yep. And how exactly do you plan on completing the prophecy without the death of my daughter? I honestly don't really care if she dies or not. To be honest, I don't care. Um, 
Perhaps her death is... No, I won't tell her that. If you believe that, then you're a bigger fool than I originally suspected. Don't you think I weighed that option before I enacted my plans? Okay, and what about Serana? You care nothing for Serana. Or That's true. Flight. Yeah, you're right. You see the tyranny of the sun as your chance at deification. Pretty much. And like Harkon, you won't hesitate to destroy anything that stands in your path. Yep. You nailed it right on the head. Serana? The stranger may call himself a vampire, but he knows nothing of our struggle. Why should I entrust you to him? This stranger has done more for me in the brief time I've known him than you've done in centuries. How dare you! I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father. Yes, he's a fanatic. He's changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? Oh, Serana, if you'd only open your eyes the moment your father discovers your role in the prophecy, that he needs your blood, you'll be in terrible danger. So to protect me, you decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. You never asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. You just expected me to follow you blindly. Both of you were obsessed with your own paths. Your motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you too. I want us to be a family again. But I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe we don't deserve that kind of happiness. Maybe it isn't for us. But we have to stop him. Before he goes too far. And to do that, we need the Elder Scroll. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed uh -huh. my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. They never your stop talking! Are still somewhat unclear to you. I wanna... But for Serana's mm -hmm. sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. Okay. Basically, I'm out for my own uh, my own benefit. I want unlimited yes. power and lots of jewels. I've kept safely secured here ever since I was imprisoned. Fortunately, you're in a position to breach the barrier that surrounds these ruins. Okay. What do I do? You need to locate the tallest of the rocky spires that uh -huh. surround these ruins. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled here. Okay. Destroy the keepers that are tending them. And it should bring the barrier down. Okay. One more word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Durnevir roaming the cairn. Be wary of him. I'm gonna kill him. The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. Cool. Okay. And I already killed one of them. Okay. Be careful. Yep. And keep my daughter safe. Shut up. 